Hi everyone, this is Laura. So I just wanted to share a couple things that um, I got online and um, a couple things from Michaels. So the first thing is this tilde paper and oh my gosh, I'm in love with this paper. This paper is so, so hard to get. And um, I got two of the paper pads last month and then I just got these and you know, it takes about 40 days to get here. So, um, I just want to share it with you guys. This one is called Christmas House and it is just so super beautiful. The quality of it is gorgeous. And, um, a lot of us girls in the United States don't get to have this paper. It's not readily available at all. So, um, I'm just in love with it, and um, so these are the papers, and then there's um, some cutouts too, or yeah, pop-out type little things here. So that's the Christmas house, and then I um, got the flower garden, and it is super pretty. You can't really tell in the video, but this is like a really pale, pale bluish color. These are just so pretty. I mean, it kind of almost reminds me of wallpaper. Well, I would like to have a um, cute girly room done in like this. That would be a gorgeous wallpaper for um, a super girly scrap room. Love this too. So um, these are my new Tilda papers. So that's Flower Garden and Christmas House. Um, and then the other thing I got, and this is my second order off of eBay, and um, I showed this before, it's Miss Val's Creations, but um, I didn't go on the dot com, I went on eBay, and I can't find these stick pins on her um, website, but um, I got them on eBay, and I got... Um, this time I got a hundred of them for $27. Um, and these are just, you guys, if you guys decide to get them, you will absolutely love them if you love making stick pins. They are so, so nice. And they don't have anything on the end there except that little tiny pin head. So, and I just take this part off. And it is a stick pin. Because um, people have asked that. They're really sharp, and they're just the best quality I've ever seen. And um, so, like, this is one of my stick pins here. So you can just put, you know, whatever you want up here instead of having to, you know, have a pearl or whatever, you know, we find it, like Hobby Lobby or Joann's or whatever. So, um, and then here's another one here. So I just love these stick pins, plus they're three inches long. Okay, so Miss Val's Creations on eBay, if you guys are interested. And then um, I went to Michael's and I got some more of these um, little bead caps. And um, there's 12 in here, and I, and I think these were 30% off. And then I also found these, and there's 82 pieces. These weren't on sale. But I thought these would look really pretty on the stick pins, too. So, um, I think these were $3.99. And then, for all the arty cake lovers out there, um, I made an arty cake bracelet. And this is what it looks like. And I put this charm on there. And this one. This one right here. Let me turn it around. And this one, and this one, and this one says, I live a charmed life. So I thought that was cute since there's a bunch of charms on there. So, um, this is just super duper cute on. It's, um, pretty heavy and kind of loud and kind of gaudy, but it's so cute. So, um, that is my arty cake charm bracelet. And then, um, when I was at Michael's, I decided to get another one. 
So I got this one here, and I just thought this one was super pretty. So um, this one just has like one strand of pearls, and then like the little um, rhinestones, and then um, two different kinds of, or three different kinds of chain. So I thought that was super cute. So I've hoarded them long enough. I decided to break some out and make something because they're just super cute to um, wear. But this um, bracelet that I made, um, it is the actual bracelet came off of this, and it is the chain with glass accents, and it's um, AL two nine three two zero if you guys are interested. I got the idea out of um, the little um, oops, the little book right here. So um, that's that one right there. And they just made, I think they are using two here on the front. So, but they made a necklace on that one and I made a bracelet. So anyway, that is all I've got for today and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.